Children, here we are again, and it's story time today. So it's time to read a book. It's time to read a book. It's time to read a book. It's story time. And this book is called Maybe a Bear Ate It. Crunch, crunch, crunch. Maybe a bear ate it. Little Teddy is on his bed. It's time to go to sleep. He loves to read his favorite book. Ah, oh, he reads one page, two pages, three pages, four pages, five, and he falls asleep. Ah, ring, ring, wake up. Oh, oh. he looks around. My book, a bear. Maybe a stegosaurus stomped on it. Stomp, stomp, stomp. Maybe a rhino ran away with it. Run, run, run! Uh-oh, here it is. <gasps> but maybe a bat <laughs> flew high, high up in the sky with my book. <sighs> maybe a shark. Swallowed it. Gulp. There it is. It is Tommy. Do 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 do. Maybe an elephant fell asleep on it. Crunch. <laughs> Well, I can't, I can't go to sleep without it. So I better, I better look for it. I'm looking. Oh, book. Oh, book, where are you? I'm looking, looking, looking in the sink. No, it's not in the sink. Is it in the washing machine? No, it's not there. I'm looking in a vase. I'm looking in the pots. Oh no, where's my book? I'm, I'm still looking. I'm looking, I'm looking in the bag. I'm looking in my drawers. I'm looking, hey look, hey look, hey look, I, I found my book. It was under my bed. My favorite book! I found it! 
You know what? I love my book. I love it. I love it. I love it. And now, tonight, I can go back to sleep reading my favorite book. And that is the end of the story. And I know that you must have a favorite book when you go to sleep. But remember, don't lose it. Bye, boys and girls.